some Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, but this isn't Super Mystery Dungeon. This is Explorers of Time, honestly. Um, I have a Explorers of Time ROM, you know, this trusty one that you always see when I play Drawn to Life. Um, new cast, I'm Pikachu, well, not quite Pikachu, and that's not quite Charmander. You'll get into that, or you won't get into that, I'll get into that later. Maybe you'll get into the whole thing. Um, we're not exactly caught up. I played a lot. <laughs> it felt like a lot. In fact, so far, <laughs> the part that I'm at is, um, the, I just finished the Apple Woods. So, we're gonna pick up from there, except don't expect, don't expect, expect it to be, you know, exactly a straight line up through here. It'll probably just be, I'm gonna record this episode of, uh, right after Apple Woods. Just to kind of say, hey everyone, we're back, we're playing this one now, okay? Super, <laughs> this isn't a hiatus, because that stupid fucking polyrath. I've played that off camera so many times, seeing if I could beat it, and I just can't. I don't know why, I just can't. But, <laughs> anyway, we're doing this now. And, uh, you know, I'm just going to do an episode here, maybe on my own time I'll play ahead. Maybe we'll do an episode of the Craggy Coast, dude, who knows. You know, just whatever whatever comes until we get caught up. Quicksand Cave. Yeah. I actually went back and I checked. <laughs> um, technically, this is this would be um, episode 18. This is, this is how far back we're at. I think we're at episode 34 or something like that. 30-something, I know. And all of this happened in episode 18. So kind of took a little bit of a step back. But you know what? At least we're we're back. We're playing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. And you know what the best part about this is? Since we've already seen all of it, I can not only fast forward it with B, I can fast forward it with ultra speed. Yeah, I'm not gonna pay attention to any of the dialogue or whatnot because I already did this. So I know you're asking, well, why am I doing it again? Well, um, just kind of say, hey, I'm back and I'm doing this now. You know. An extra. If you want to see story progress, it's not going to be here, obviously. This is just fun time for me. Also, I wanted to play Pokemon Star. I did. That was my goal. Because I've just been playing... My goal was to, you know, just play this on my own time until I get up to the damn quicksand cave. But, as it turns out, my stupid ass, um... Premiere Pro won't keep fucking crashing when I'm trying to export videos, and it's pissing me off! Um, I'm gonna go to the beach cave since there's three of them. You don't know how this game works. So, instead of me explaining or talking about the game, let's, um, have a mini story time. So, if you have not seen a particular episode of New Super Mario Bros., I, um, discussed how. Let me see why I need to put storage first. I discussed. How that's good. I was in class the one day, and I got um, fucking caught watching The Office on my girlfriend's uh, phone, which was on her desk. So why I got docked, I don't know. However, I wanted to do a follow-up for that because we just had class yesterday. And the goal, the plan was for me to go up there and not really confront, but to be like, hey, I'm just curious, why I got it, this is really unfair. That's a lot of enemies. Um, lo and behold, I did not do that, not because I pushed out, but because she literally came in like right before the fucking class started, so I didn't have time. So I was like, you know what, it's whatever, it's only 5% of my grade, it's not that important. The end of class, she um, asked me and her to stay just so she can tell us something. And so we're like, oh, she's going to talk about this. And I'm like preparing myself. I'm like, oh, I know exactly what I'm going to say. Sure enough, she goes, for your participation today, I want to award you two all your points back. And we're just like, oh, bah, 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 thank you. So <laughs> I, ran, I spent like... I don't know how long that episode ranting about that whole situation, and now there's it's over. Our points are back. It's pretty meaningless. 
Hey, Emperor. So, in case you wanted to know, kind of, you know, what happened after that. Well, there you go. I had another story that I wanted to tell um, during Drawn to Life, but we had a lot of exposition, so I never got a chance to. And now I'm trying to remember what it was. I don't. Maybe it'll come to me. Mustn't have been that important, obviously. Anyway, yeah, we did it. Max Elixir and some other stuff. Jeez, watching them eat at like the speed of sound is just like really comedic to me. Also, I don't know if it's the emulator or what, but this takes so long to save. I don't know why. I, I remember all like Pokemon Gen 4 always like so fucking long to save the game. I guess they like in Explorers of Sky they really amped up how long it takes to save. Oh fuck, I'm doing this now? Hang on a minute. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, now I'm ready. No, 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 no. Oops. Wait, no, 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 no. Uh, Charizard. I'm trying to move the... Here we go. Good enough. I wasn't ready, but it's okay. Alright. That is a slack off. So far I've done this game twice during this playthrough, and each time I've got 6 out of 6. And most of them I'm just guessing. I wanna say Venusaur. Most of them are pretty obvious. Plant Knight. But then they got somewhere, like they just give you like a little circle, and it's like, well that could be anything. I remember this one! This one's fucking Hoot Hoot! I remember that because they gave me like hoo hoo and Empoleon one time, and I was like Empoleon. They're like, now it's hoo hoo. I the hell? Octillery? What was say? Hey, I was gonna say. Hey, I was gonna say who else has that weird ass footprint except for a tentacle? Yeah, there we go again with the stupid ass little circle. It's probably Chikorita. It might be too big for Chikorita. Hey, never mind, never mind. We did it. Okay, back to back to normal mode. <gasps> Woo! <laughs> okay, let's save our adventure. Honestly, it takes me more time to save the game than it does me playing the game. Especially with it like sped up. Not gonna lie, I really like the combination of Fanfy and um, Vulpix, only because it's two Pokemon you like rarely see, and like you know everyone else, Krieger, Crow, and Charmander. I actually didn't choose them, okay? Um, I did not. I was <clears throat> I was laying in bed one day with my lovely gal, and how did? Did I not do it? <laughs> and, um, I had her take the uh, personality test because, you know, that's just the kind of dork I am. You know, fuck sex. <laughs> but anyway, she did and she got the Pikachu, and I was like, yeah, you can go ahead and choose your partner if you like. And she was like, I want Charmander. So she chose Charmander. What a lovely gal. However, you might have seen, because I haven't um, made any attention to it, their names aren't actually Pikachu and Charmander. Not sure if any of you caught that. If not, you'll probably catch it here soon. Charmander's name is Charty B. Guess whose idea that was? And Pikachu's name is Pikatine. Ah, oh, I love her so much. <laughs> Especially Charty B. That's turned into like our own little inside joke. But also, I've never heard that. I feel like that's such an obvious one to make. Is like Charty B, but yeah, I've never heard that one before. 
So I'm going to claim it right now. Claiming it as my own patent, Shardy B. That's our thing. Picatine, someone probably made that. But. In case you're dumb, it's a play on words of Pikachu and Nicotine, so. There we go. What the hell are you doing here? Get the fuck out. You, okay, okay, dipshit. Look, I can do it too. I can do it too. Yeah. No. I don't need stupid ass party members. That suck. I told myself when I was recording that whenever I did record this, I wasn't going to um use the fast forward button. That was short lived. In fact, I like emphasized the point that now I can do it. So. Obviously, it was going to be broken at some point. As of right now, honestly, I know that so far my experience for my second playthrough has been really, um, like, not fairly judged of Super Mystery Dungeon, but so far I'm having a lot more fun playing through Explorers than I have uh, Mystery Dun or Super Mystery Dungeon. And honestly, I think it's just because of the fact of, like, it's a lot harder than this, I feel. It is a lot harder. And, you know, difficulty's not bad at all. In fact, I encourage it, especially in Mystery Dungeon, because I feel like I'm definitely a veteran when it comes to these uh, type of games. However, unfairness is something totally different, because I think I'm, um, you know, pretty, I think I'm pretty, uh, justified to say that was complete bullshit what happened <laughs> at that stupid fucking, um, juncture with the goddamn motherfucking piece of shit man. Oh, sorry, what I meant to say was the, uh, Hellwitz. But you, you get the point. The hell did you pick up? What the hell was that? Oh, my fan turned on. I was gonna say, so far I'm, like, skipping every single destination floor, but to be fair, there are the stairs. <laughs> I gotta take the stairs. I used to, like, explore. I'd, be, like, get in the room with, uh, stairs, and I'd be like, Oh, man, now I gotta go explore and find the person. And I'm just like, yeah, fuck it. There's the stairs, you know. Good enough for me. So, I'm pretty sure this is the cutscene where... Is it? No. Oh, I'd have to wait another day, but oh, then we get to go on the Super Expedition Extravaganza, which we'll do, which I might do, or we might, I don't know, all depends what, what stars align, so next time we'll make more progress, so I'll see you guys then. I'm not used to that thing being over there. <laughs>